What is going on everyone? This is Ninja Geek here, and just today we got this new trailer from Call of Duty, the official YouTube channel. We'll leave a link on screen and in the description below right now. But this is a new multiplayer trailer for the Black Ops 3 beta, which of course is coming August 19th to PlayStation 4. Uh, and we get to see a little bit of cinematics here, different things, of course, within the game of itself. But there are some things that I want to talk about. We see some different kill streaks here, so I slowed it down so you can kind of see them right here. As you can see, the Hellstorm missile is back. We kind of figured that was coming back already. But then we see the Hover Car XD, basically the RCXD. Uh, just the, it hovers instead of, you know, goes on the ground, so that's a little bit different, so you see a lot of different things here in a cinematic view, and I slowed it down, of course, obviously, because going too fast, it's just like, whoa, and there, that guy seemed to have some kind of like an explosive grenade thingy, I have no idea if that's a specialist or what, uh, but... And there, here we get to see the new Dark Kill Streak. It looks exactly like the Hunter Killer, except it's controllable instead of you uh, throwing it in the air in Black Ops 2 and then just letting it go. It looks like it's controllable now. So I guess it could, it's not as overpowered as it was because you control it yourself instead of the thing just automatically going by itself. But uh, yeah, this was quite a short trailer. It's nothing like really insane to go over, but I am going to play it again here just so we can go back and look over it as we go along. And here, of course, this is another specialist where we see the gravity spikes. We already knew about that. But there's going to be seven multiplayer modes, three plus multiplayer maps, and eight specialists that we get to try out within this beta. So that's almost nine because there's going to be nine specialists within the Black Ops 3 beta. And, uh, I mean, Black Ops 3 game in general, in the beta, there's going to be eight specialists that we get to try out. And we also found out about the two new specialists coming within Black Ops 3 beta, known as Battery and Spectre. Now, Battery has the weapon, the War Machine, which you just saw within the trailer. It's basically a grenade launcher that fires time fuse bouncing frag grenades, which explode on contact with an enemy. And that's the weapon, and his ability is Kinetic Armor, which is charged electrically reactive armor that sublimates enemy bullets on contact, turning them into vapor, which dissipates harmlessly. So the bullets, if you activate this, bullets will not harm you for that period of time. Spectre, in fact, has a weapon called the Ripper, which deploys mono-edge twin blades before gracefully dissecting victims with lethal surgical precision. We also see that within the trailer here as well. And his ability is active camo which basically advanced materials rapidly change their properties, guiding photons over their surfaces instead of reflecting them, rendering Spectre temporarily invisible, which basically means you could cloak in Black Ops 3. I do not like that at all, but again, we'll have to find out within the beta how this one's going to turn out. There's going to be in temporarily invisible dudes. I don't know how about that. I never like cloaking at all. It came within Titanfall. Didn't really like it. Advanced Warfare. They had it. People didn't really use it though because no one really uses the Exo abilities a lot. Uh, but I don't know about this ability to go cloak with this. Uh, I'm not too sure, but we'll have to find out and see about that. So, uh, you know, we're going to get to try out each of them and see what it is. And also in the beta as well, we get to try out the paint shop and weapon customization. So I'm thrilled to see how that's going to go out. I'm going to have a video coming out in a couple of days talking about the Black Ops 3 Gunsmith versus Advanced Warfare Supply Drops and which one I like better. So stay tuned for that video as well. Just thinking of it as we're talking about the Gunsmith options there. And also keep in mind that anything that you unlock during this beta does not carry over to your multiplayer. Once this beta ends and you finish off, that's it. You have to rank up all over again. It's not like a progression where you can just keep going. Of course, you know, it's going to be within the beta time extended period. You're going to be able to level up and stuff like that and get all these weapon unlocks, perks, etc. Score streaks. But... It's not going to carry over to your progress when the game finally comes out on November 6th. So you got to keep that in mind. It does say that in the beginning of the trailer as well. So that's really it. Leave your thoughts below on what you think about this trailer. And again, there's going to be a link so you can see the full thing. It's not really that long, but it just show off a lot of new score streaks that you may not have seen before. And some of the specialist abilities. And that's it for this video. I'll see you on whatever my next video happens to be. I'm Ninja Geek. I'm out. Peace.